Americans uh, from the Impeach Obama March in D.C. and also I'm a group member and admin of Americans Call to Action. Um, you've seen some pictures on Facebook where we did overpass, uh, overpasses for Obama's impeachment and everything. Anyways, I'm super, super amped up and excited. I'm like very manic right now. Um, I just got back to Brooklyn from Manhattan. It's pouring rain today, but guess what I did? I went to West 51st Street because Senator Rand Paul, he was coming for a fundraiser to New York City. So I went out there in the pours of rain with a beautiful sign saying New York loves Rand. And then, uh, you know, 2016 because I wanted to run for president. Anyways, uh, there's some Occupy wannabes, you know, protesting about the Sandy Relief because they never read the bill and they're all down with, you know, New Jersey Governor Chris Pithy. I shouldn't say that, but that's what it is. Uh, they all look like extras from the movie, you know, The Perfect Storm and like their, their extra bit got cut off on the floor in editing. That's what they look like. Anyways, um, the main focus why I went there was because with the group Americans Call to Action, we had an appointment, actually Melissa McGee had an appointment and she was nice enough to let me accompany her. It was uh, with Congressman Rep. Wolf's legislative director, Tom Cullion, and what he had mentioned to us is regarding HRES 36, which is Rep. Wolf's resolution calling for a select committee for Benghazi. Um, he had mentioned, Mr. Culligan, that they were sort of disappointed and quite surprised that nobody from the Senate had submitted a letter to the remaining Republican Congress people who have yet to co-sponsor the bill because John Boehner is kicking, dragging in his heels into the sand and doing nothing about it. So we need the Republican majority to pass this in order to get it go, get it going. Anyways, uh, the whole point was I had typed up a letter, included all 400 names of every member of Americans Call to Action, and I brought that out there. I wanted to try to hand deliver to Senator Paul if I could. Um, that wasn't happening, but super cool news. Um, his assistant, Sergio, um, he actually came out and said that Senator Paul had asked to get a picture of me, I guess with the sign, I don't know about the Pete Obama part, but he, you know, whatever. And I asked him if he could please give him the letter. And being that he, he is directly, uh, you know, an assistant for the Senator, he did. So, touchdown! And, you know, as I keep saying to everybody, Goal! And that's a reference to soccer, even though I don't play it. Okay, so I'm super excited. I did not get any pictures of the senator because he finally, I was waiting and whatever. He came out of the door and I was like, wait, you know, let me get a pic. But because I guess all the Occupy wannabes, you know, standing there like shouting and being disgusting, you know, he, he went. Okay, um, that's it. Then I walked up, I was going to go, go to the train, uh, you know, 42nd Street and Broadway. On my way, I passed Fox, because why not? And guess who I saw? One of his other people. And I asked him, please, can I get a picture with him finally? And he's like, well, he's going to be in this, uh, you know, in Fox for a couple hours. I'm like, come on, man. You know, I just want one pic, you know, whatever. He's cool. He rocks it out. So he says, okay, well, get ready. He's coming. And I didn't know if he meant coming out of the door or coming in the door. So, of course, he passes me by again. So whatever, you know, Senator Paul, if you get to see this in any way, shape, or form, dude, you rock so hard, it's like ridiculous. Love you. Um, but this dude, he took my email address and he said, you know what, if they have some publicity, things or whatever, they can maybe notify me. So that's cool. So anyways, the whole point of getting the letter into his hands, it's a done deal. So let's hope that he rocks that in the Senate and gets some people to get the rest of the Republican Congress people to sign off on it. So that's it. Hugs, happiness, I'm so amped up, it's like ridiculous. I've got my sister filming this because I'm like, whatever. Okay, take care, talk to y'all soon. See you at the next rally, bye.